hi guys welcome to my channel uh, in my last video I talked on how to register and create an account on MTFE which is metaverse foreign exchange so today I'm gonna be teaching us how to do your security authentication on MTFE now before you can trade before your account can be verified you have to go through a security authentication process yeah before I go forward please don't forget to like share and comment and also subscribe on my channel okay so here it is when you log in you go to profile and then just above you see security authentication so today i'm going to be using pictures and arrows to explain what i'm going to be talking about so just above here you see security authentication you click it and then it takes you all the way down to this place now just follow the arrow click on mobile phone number or email verification you keep going now there are some things listed out here you see real name phone number email id card now just make sure you fill it as you're being asked now this id card it means you can use either your passport your international passport your school id card the driver's license all the need is the number the number on the id card so as for bank account you put in your bank account so if you have um if you're using Zenit Bank or GTB or whatever country you are, you just need the number. So you can put the number. Then the bank name, if it's Zenit Bank, you put in Zenit Bank. If it's UBA, you put in UBA. And then bank branch, it means where you registered, where where you opened the account. Was it in Lagos? Was it in Kogi? So wherever you opened it, you write that there. And then you click on Submit so immediately you submit it would show pending review or once it's it's done it takes about two to three to five minutes and then it would show complete so once you're done with this stage your account has been verified thank you very much for watching please don't forget to like share and subscribe Bye.